Did you know that by 2025, 48% of businesses intend to move at least half of their apps to the cloud? The main reason behind this shift are the increased flexibility, scalability, and cost reduction of the cloud services. As a result, there is a high scope for cloud computing, which has increased job opportunities as well. Do you want to know more about the cloud computing scope in the future? Continue watching this video to know more. But before we begin with this video, make sure to like and subscribe to IntelliPath's YouTube channel so you never miss any update coming from us. Let us understand what exactly is cloud computing. Think about all the stuff on your computer or phone like photos, videos, music, and important files. They take up a lot of space, right? Making your storage full. What if you could move all that stuff to a huge, invisible computer somewhere far away? That's basically what cloud computing is all about. You have the option to store everything online rather than on your device. The cloud is essentially a big online storage area where you can secure all your stuff. It functions similarly to a huge storage box that you can use to store anything you want and you can access it from any location through an internet connection. So if you're using services like Google Drive, Dropbox, iCloud, etc. and storing your large files over here, it means that you are using services of cloud computing. You can upload, download, view and share your files with others whenever you want through the internet. Next, let's talk about why we need cloud computing. First, access anywhere. Imagine you're at your friend's place and they ask to see your vacation photos. Instead of carrying your laptop, you can just simply log into your cloud storage from your phone and show them those photos. Next, fewer storage worries. Our devices such as phones, tablets, and laptops have limited space. So when you store everything on these devices, you might run out of space sooner or later. But with cloud storage, you have practically unlimited space, depending on your subscription plan. So you don't need to delete your previous data to make room for new ones. The cloud service takes care of storing all that data for you. Then we have sharing made easy. Now consider you're working on a group project with your classmates or colleagues. Instead of emailing back and forth huge files, you can create a shared folder on the cloud service. For example, if you use Google Drive, you can create a folder for your project and share the link with your team. Anyone with access can then view, edit, and add files to this folder in real time. Next up, we have cost savings. When it comes to cost effectiveness, cloud computing is best for organizations. A corporation would typically need to make costly server and IT infrastructure investments if it is required to operate on complicated software programs or store significant volumes of data. Businesses can subscribe to these services using cloud computing. They just have to pay for the processing power or storage. Since companies don't have to purchase and operate the servers, this pay-as-you-go strategy can result in significant financial savings over time. Now, Moving to our main agenda, now that we have understood why we need cloud computing, let's talk about the future of cloud computing. The scope of cloud computing in the coming years is promising and the potential for innovation and efficiency gains is virtually limitless. Here are some reasons that prove that the scope of cloud computing is expanding rapidly and revolutionizing the way businesses operate in the digital age. First, improved cloud services. It operates similarly to a very fast internet connection that enables quick file uploads and downloads. Furthermore, it won't slow down when storing an increased amount of your files, including documents, videos, and pictures. Cloud computing is like a toolbox that keeps getting better and better. It's like having a toolbox full of tools where every time you open it, you find a new tool that makes your work easier. Cloud computing is always changing to give you better services. Next, we have increase in demand. As more and more businesses and people understand the advantages of using cloud computing, the need for these services is likely to grow a lot. This means that there will be plenty of new opportunities for those who wish to work in this industry. Hence, the cloud computing scope for freshers is bright. They have a lot of employment options in the cloud computing to look forward to. Next, we have virtualization. Suppose you have one computer that performs the functions of 10. Rather than purchasing 10 different computers, you can get one computer to perform the functions of 10. As you don't have to purchase and maintain 10 actual machines, this saves money. On number four, we have cloud security. 
Now, looking into the future of cloud computing, it's clear that security is going to be a big deal. With new technology and security measures to keep everything safe, experts are working to improve cloud security even more. Security is crucial for everyone, from people who store their photos in the cloud to big companies that store sensitive customer data. Next, number five, we have serverless computing. Normally, when developers create applications or websites, they have to deal with setting up and managing servers to run their code. This can be problematic because they have to worry about things like how many web servers they need, how to scale them up if the app gets popular, and how to keep them updated and secure. But with serverless computing, developers can forget about all of that. They can focus entirely on writing their code, knowing that the cloud provider will take care of running it on servers in the background. It's like having a magical behind the scenes team. Next on number six, we have hybrid multi-cloud approach. Hybrid multi-cloud approach. The hybrid cloud and multi-cloud strategy is the next concept that cloud computing is headed towards. This indicates that businesses are beginning to adopt a variety of cloud service offerings. These services offer on-premises clouds private clouds and public clouds like Google Cloud or Amazon Web Services. Why are businesses acting this way? Well, it's all about getting the best of everything. Organizations can have more options and flexibility in how they handle their data and apps by utilizing this combination of cloud services. This provides greater flexibility, efficiency, and cost effectiveness in managing data and applications. Now let's move ahead and talk about the scope of cloud computing as a career. The potential for a career in cloud computing is vast and promising. Firstly, let's talk about demand. The demand for skilled cloud computing professionals is skyrocketing as more businesses move their operations to the cloud. This means there are ample opportunities for freshers and experienced professionals. In countries like India, where the tech industry is booming, the scope is particularly bright. There is a huge demand for the following roles in the industry. First, cloud architecture. Next, cloud developer. Third, cloud engineer. Fourth, cloud security specialist. And fifth, cloud infrastructure engineer. Cloud computing has a place for everyone, regardless of their interest in networking, security, data management, coding, or even business planning. You may be creating cloud solutions, overseeing cloud infrastructure, protecting data, or making the most use of cloud resources. The options are endless. A career in the cloud computing also has many personal benefits in addition to its professional ones. Many cloud computing positions offer competitive pay, flexible work schedules, and remote work possibilities. Additionally, you can explore different sectors because there is a broad demand for cloud skills across numerous businesses including healthcare, banking, and e-commerce. Speaking of services, let's take a look at the cloud service providers. So, first we have Amazon Web Services. AWS is an Amazon company that offers an extensive range of cloud computing services. It provides many services, such as machine learning, database administration, storage solutions, and processing power. On number two, we have Microsoft Azure. Microsoft's cloud computing platform, Azure, provides services like AI solutions, data analytics, virtual machines, and app services. It is well known for integrating with Office 365 and Windows Server. Then on number three, we have Google's cloud services platform offers machine learning, data analytics, data storage, and processing capacity. It is well known for the TensorFlow machine learning framework and BigQuery data warehouse. To conclude, technologies like cloud computing are here to stay. Companies need to embrace and adjust to its ongoing evolution. Its effect is both inspiring and substantial. Many businesses, no matter their size, have recognized its cost effectiveness in delivering services. That's it for this video. To receive more videos like this, hit the bell icon and subscribe to IntelliPath's YouTube channel. Just a quick info guys, IntelliPath offers advanced certification in cloud computing and DevOps. Through this course, you will master cloud and DevOps competitors. You will have the opportunity to work on projects involving AWS, Azure, DevOps, Python, Java, Linux, and much more from the top industry experts. With this course, we have already helped thousands of professionals in successful career transition. You can check out the testimonials on our Achievers channel, whose link is given in the description below. Without a doubt, this course can set your careers to new heights.
So visit the course page link given below in the description and take the first step towards the career growth in the field of cloud computing and DevOps.